Robert Browning is sitting in the Duval County Jail charged with a lewd battery. He taught Bible school at the Cedar Creek Christian School on Lane Avenue. And now the girl's father and pastor are reacting strongly to those charges. News 4 Jacks reporter Eric Gavigny joins us live outside the church. Eric, sounds like quick action was taken as soon as the church found out about Browning's arrest. Yes, the, the, the church and the school officials took very quick action. In fact, they tell me that Browning had worked here for as a teacher for the past six years, but they recently fired him after learning he was under a criminal investigation for allegations of sexual misconduct with a young student. Police say the investigation into allegations of sexual misconduct by 59-year-old Robert Browning began on July 29th. That's when the father of a female student inspected her phone. I found everything. Yep. What was your initial reaction when you saw that? A uh, shock. He says he found nude pictures on his teenage daughter's phone that had been exchanged between his daughter and Browning. The girl told investigators the nude images were of Browning. She also told detectives that she and Browning performed sex acts inside the school she attended and where Browning worked as a teacher. Police say they found text messages on her phone revealing a conversation about sex acts the two performed while FaceTiming in the nude. Pastor John Montgomery says the school took swift action after learning about the evidence police collected. The individual was uh, uh, terminated um, immediately. Uh, we were shocked. Uh, the uh, faculty and staff, we, uh, they were shocked that this man um, did what he's been accused of. This is where police say Robert Browning lives. As soon as we pulled up, two women opened the door and said no comment. Then they asked us to leave. A neighbor who wouldn't go on camera says the allegations are false. He also says he believes Browning is a good Christian man. Meanwhile, the girl's father says the ordeal has devastated his family. It's torn our family apart. Um, my daughter doesn't want to speak to me anymore. The Cedar Creek Christian School teaches kids K-4 through 12th grade. Police want to know whether Browning had any inappropriate contact with any other child. Now, Browning remains in jail tonight on a $250,000 bond. Coming up at 11, you're going to hear from school officials who are announcing a policy change uh, to the school here uh, to prevent this from happening again. Reporting live, Eric Avigny, Channel 4, The Local Station. Eric, any word whether the school did a background check on Browning before they hired him? Yes, yeah, school officials tell me they did an extensive black background check on Browning, and from what they could tell initially, there was nothing, not one thing in his background that raised any red flags. Eric Avenier reporting to us live. Thank you, Eric.